Hello, it's very nice of you to have me. Thank you. Yep. Syndicate no trumpets you there or lovely. anything. You just got a standard introduction. No Sorry about that. Yeah, standard shit. Okay, so we both we both got it open on our screens in quick time, so we can frame yeah. by frame through frame by frame through the video, and we can see everything in like nice, clear, crisp HD. Um, and hopefully we'll bring you some more information that you don't know. Straight away, starting off here, this is the control room. That's like what we've named it for this video. Um, not confirmed or anything. Uh, <laughs> nope. Here you can see there's just a simple staircase leading up into it, and for a lot of people don't notice because this trailer moves very fast because we've got it still here. Um, there's actually a television on the right hand side of that room. You can see through the glass. Now, Ben, what and you can do? pretty much guess that there's a mystery box there as well. But yeah. So we're guessing there's a TV. There. Yeah, we're going to guess that the mystery box will be like either in the room or underneath the te television because that's what it was like on five. Yep. You can see the where the mystery box was there. And it might show some other things around the map, but I believe that on 5 it did sh show the Illuminati symbol, so maybe it might show some like new Easter eggs that might be scattered to lead towards the next map or yep. the storyline, which is pretty interesting. Also, you can see the window in the middle uh, of the actual building, uh, which could be a... It does seem more, most likely that the zombies are going to crawl through there, seeing as though each like building in zombies has uh, like access for zombies to come in. So that looks like a, a breaking point. Yeah, a breaking yeah. point. And I'm not quite sure, but that could be a breaking point as well at the bottom of the stairs where the metal gates are because it looks like on five where the actual yep. metal gates are itself. Anyway, you know, like on the middle section where people do the run around, you can see the metal gates that yep. they break off. So that looks like a breaking point and that looks like a breaking point. Could be an okay room to hold off if you get two people up at the top of the stairs and then two people looking at the window. Um, there's... There's also a good escape route, which uh, a lot of people aren't clocked onto, because if we just skip a bit forward into the actual frame, you see the electricity sparking on the rooftop uh, straight away, and you can see there's actually an elevator there, because it looks like a, a proper like sat add-on to the back of the building. So it looks like we're looking at an elevator there. don't know whether you have to activate the elevator. Uh, what would you say, Ben? Link anything up, or...? Uh, I would go. say yes. Oh, turn the power um, on, like. Well, I'd usually. say I'd say I'd say you have to buy it. I wouldn't say you have to activate. Oh, it, like on five, to pay it. to open it and then. Perhaps. Oh yeah, yeah you could clear yeah. debris to get in it and then d back down. You could. That that would be a good idea. Yeah. That's good. And okay, so now we're gonna skip uh, further back on into the. Did I miss anything there? Or are we all good to move on? Uh, I think you could probably mention the back courtyard and uh, what looks and could be considered as an alternative route to get to what we're about to show them, which is the, the main rocket silo. Ah, or, yeah. Uh, as you can see, rocket, like, on the left-hand uh, side, if the elevator does actually go down, it'll go into this courtyard section where you can see, like, if um, if I just flick back here a bit, uh, you can see there's, like, an, it looks like another bit. Is that another building they can go into on the left with, like, an open rooftop? Or is that... It's not a building. It just looks like a uh, an abandoned. It's a building without a roof. Yeah, 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 yeah basically. Yeah, yeah, just a one -one. And at the bottom of the stairs, looks like we can go right. So you can actually run all the way around this building uh, instead of going through it. So two routes. Yeah, two, two routes. Two routes. So it's like you can do, take a direct route or basically like a, a go round route, like on double linear. Du like double linear. Wow. Hmm. Very interesting. It's clicking now, yeah, isn't it? Yeah, it's right. very much clicking, right. For, 43 seconds. Let's jump to there now. And then we'll... Yeah, let's jump. We'll, we'll see what we can find. Jump away. Right, I'm at... Yeah, I'm pretty yeah, much... Yeah, right, so cool. here we go. We're starting off... M Big M60 looks like a turret that we've seen on Kino, which I'm probably guessing it's right with the red lights ambient on it. Um, what else can we see? Have we noticed anything yet? Just a simple... You can pretty much definitely yeah, say oh, yeah. that clan tag is not on that. Yeah, it's not a custom clan guy, tag, guys. It will not appear. It's just no. purely for trailer purposes. And uh, something that we can see yeah. there nicely on the floor looking at us, can't we? Is that a nice little uh, monkey died on the floor? And what's he got right on his arm? I can't actually fully make it out, but it looks like he's got some sort of badge on his arm. He does. It looks like some sort of emblem. I thought... Yeah. I, at first I was thinking, like... Because um, a lot of people haven't noticed yet, but there's different coloured monkeys, so different coloured monkeys for stealing your perks, uh, which we'll show later on. That's a good idea. Um, we'll show later yeah, on. Yeah, you should tell Trey about it. that. That's really good. Yeah, I'm, I'm sure they haven't yeah. done it <laughs> done it already. Uh, but I was yeah, looking really at the cool. emblem on the um, on the arm. Uh, that at first I thought that could be the perk of what it steals, but then I was just like, maybe that's a bit too into detail. So it's more just... likely to be the CCCP yeah, rocket. Because that's like scattered everywhere. Okay, so moving on yeah. now at like 43. Um, 
Well, actually, there's a breaking point above that Gatling gun that you might want to mention for. Well, it's actually a route back down into the silo, but is it... you might want to mention the zombies can come from up there. Is that where we see as the well actual players. zombie coming from the right hand side? You can, but, but, all, but players can enter from there as well, they would say. Was it like a, so, are we saying there's a staircase from there? Um, not a staircase, but but I would I would say that players can enter from there. That, that, uh, that's not possibly the. Um... Yeah. That's not possibly the courtyard section, is it? Behind, is that where the elevator? No, 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 no. That's the other end of the map. That's the other end of the map. Oh yeah, it must be. No, no, no. You're getting you confused. Okay, so no. now we're at 43 seconds. We Moving can see to... the zombies walking into oh. us, and the nice. What's the actual term for this machine that spins round? Do we know? I don't know what the term is, but I call it the crusher. I call it something else, but I don't know if we're being PG, so I call it the crusher. No, we're not being PG. Um, we are fully go out, swear the fuck whatever you want. Uh, I call it the motherfucking crunker. Um, <laughs> what a name! It trunks the fucking a... zombies' heads in. Yeah, the motherfucking crunker. Yeah, um, that's awesome. Does it just? That's copyright, by the way. If oh, you want access yeah, right, to it, yeah, no, that's my name. copyright. If people start using it, my video. <laughs> All right, that's how it works. Okay, so yeah. we've got like Russian writing as on the top, as we can see, and obviously looking straight at these zombies, we've got. We've actually got zombies in space outfits at the moment, haven't we? Because uh, you can see the smashed glass helmet that looks like retro. Um, like from the films, where it's just like you know, like a glass bowl on the head. Uh, so we've seen yeah, them, yeah. Uh, the the lab coat zombies, and there was, and then the the normal monkeys, and also the gas mask zombies. Because when we skip a frame in a minute, you'll be able to see that. Um, it looks like. Well, I think actually it's something you may have potentially missed is that the um, ones dressed as um, astronauts have um, stethoscopes on them, which is quite important for the future. But but it's it's important to notice that they have stethoscopes on them. Um, ah, but there you go. Um, because they're, they're they're technically what could I think I'm th oh, this is obviously guessing, but uh, I think you could consider them. They were trainee doctors who were going to be sent somewhere. Oh yeah, to do something. Oh. Uh, uh, yeah, I thought, so I would. Oh yeah, so they're doctors yeah. to a cure. Well, maybe? they're they're actually cosmonauts, but they they are the trained doctors. Um, Their faces look really time. mashed. Um, as they you can do, see in the yeah. background as well, we've got another TV screen, so that's obviously like another possibility another to have a mystery box there. Uh, then if we skip a bit further on, we can just see back entrance door. Where well, there's a airlock type door there that you can be that can be passed through. Um, no, you don't have to pay to open, just, open, just walk sensors. through it. No, 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 no. Yeah, is it? Um, does that? Oh, I thought that zombie looked like it had a, a lock on its on its foot, but it doesn't. It's just a bad camera for me. Uh, so gas mask zombies, is this know. like? Is this a possible perk that we could be looking into as a gas mask? Oh, what, your, uh, what to protect you from the Nova yeah. crawlers? Um, I, I don't know. Have you seen any Nova crawlers? We, we haven't seen them in this map. That, that's the thing. We've not seen them in this map, but we might see uh, like a comeback in maybe another map pack, hopefully, because that, you might that could be exactly what the, ma yeah. the gas masks look like. So, okay, so that's it. anything from there? Well, so you're thinking of a perk that could possibly... Uh, make you immune to that gas. Yes, yeah, so like um, if you just like it explodes it onto you, you, it just looks normal. Like and you've. It's another good you've, idea, like, and I think you've goggle should, vision like, or something like that. Um, yeah. Okay, so now we'll skip on to 45 seconds where we see someone running in. Someone who we, I'm saying tank. I, I think we're both saying tank. Someone? Are you a moron? That's Nikolai. It's not tank. It's not Nikolai. Oh, where are you? Sorry, I'm, I'm not one further than you. I'm on 45 seconds. I called you a moron for nothing. Sorry, wait, sorry. I'm 45 seconds when he runs in with yeah. the uh, death machine. Oh, yeah, with the death, death machine. Death machine, yeah, yeah, two yeah, hands yeah. taking it up, and then and you can actually see, if you like flick between the frames, he, um, you can see the back of the actual gun as well. So that's a bit more proof of it. Nice. Um, see a green light on the wall. I don't know if that has to do with anything. Um, to be honest, um, can, can you see, point out anything there apart from this... Pretty weird looking. Well, the entity, zombie. the entity in front of us, with with a, with a very interesting logo on its arm. But that entity is that a two-headed zombie? Why would they have two-headed zombies? It does look like a two-headed zombie because I can't see two arms. I can't see two legs. Oh, no, sorry, I can see two arms. I can only see two legs. Um, I can't see. I can see two arms. Yeah. Yeah. So I think we see, we shall we know a two-legged zombie there, and they look really scary. That guy looks like he's got huge eyebrows, but yeah, so Death Machine is another a perk drop, and then if we jump into 45 seconds where we see the uh, the motherfucking crunking arm or whatever spinning again, uh, this is where got we've got wrong. Nikolai. But that's Nikolai. That's Nikolai oh, there crouched, like unique Nikolai, looking like he's getting a bit old And there. a super zombie dropping from the ceiling. 
Super Zombie? Like, Sorry, no, no, no. He just like Superman, yeah. only, not Super Zombie. Um, a, yeah. a lot of people have been like, oh, it's the uh, guy of five, but I don't think they'd put the monkeys no, and not. him in, so I just think it's like... Have you seen the way he moves? He's old as fuck. <laughs> He's not going to jump down like that. Yeah, just like breaks his leg and falls... Falls, falls to the floor. Okay, but uh, yeah, starts crying. straight away we can see, see the, uh, the power symbol, can't we? So are we, we saying that right there off the screen is where the activate the power is or it's telling you where to go towards the power? Yeah, it's telling you where to go. So yeah. it's like... It's not right. It's not just there. It's like a lead off. Uh, we can see quick revive, obviously, next to a nice refresh. Well, actually, in the starting area of this map, those power things lead you straight through to the power. The power's actually fairly close to the start. Um, ah. But, and this isn't close to the start, the silo isn't that close to the start, so, um, but, yeah, that that's leading you towards it. Of course it is, I mean, they always have, so, yeah. Ah, fair enough. Um, oh. Grim Reaper in the background's yep. fairly irrelevant, there are the maps. So, it's huge, though, it's massive. Yeah, that's, like, the biggest Grim Reaper image possible. It is, so than far, the one on, it's gigantic. On Kino. Uh, so we 